In this video, we are going to learn how we can add this kind of social share icons or this kind of social share icons or sticky social share icons or you can say floating social share icons or social icons like that or social icon floating social icon or sticky social icons on your website this is very easy you need to follow simple steps the very first step is on any page where you want to display this uh, floating social share buttons or icons you just need to click on edit with elementor and you can see elementor edited has been open and here uh, in the bottom you just need to click here and add a container here you can see this is the container so we'll set the container setting so first of all we need make it uh, full width so it should be full width and uh, here the style uh, padding should be zero we don't need any padding and um, here again into the position should be fixed uh, we need a position should be fixed and here is the or um, vertical position I should say bottom so you can see this is now at the bottom okay so uh, you understand the uh, position but I just make it default for now and uh, go back and here I just search for social icon or share so here is the share buttons so I just drag and drop here so you can see one two three three jack buttons ha we have uh, I add more buttons here for example um, uh, LinkedIn we have Tumblr and here I add a new Facebook or uh, you can say WhatsApp is uh, the top of the line okay so now we have these buttons here so here in the in the view we can say icons only or we can set the text only or we can set the icon and text both so this is depend upon your uh, own choice and here is the square you can set is the rounded and uh, you can also set that um, yeah, as the as the you know circle buttons okay so now we have these uh, buttons on the on our <coughs> container so I just go here in the container and uh, here I just make these uh, as the center because we need that into the center so I just make the content as the center so you can see this is now in the center and I, I make a uh, much more uh, customization here so here in the uh, style or, or in the advance I just make the background as um, you know black so that can be differentiate okay so this is the background is the you know black as well as I make the padding uh, top uh, sorry top should be zero left I make it 20 and the right I make it also 20 as well as uh, in the border I just make the border top 20 and uh, the left 20 sorry um, the right 20 you can see this is right now okay so here we have three buttons uh, or five buttons and here we also make some more changes here uh, in the content I just change the style because uh, the color because we I don't like this the default color so here in the color I just make it the custom color so you can see this is right, right now right so I just click here and I set the theme color because I j already uh, you know save this color so in the secondary color you can also change the secondary color uh, from your choice so I just uh, make it white okay so I make it um, black okay so this is now right here and also if you click on hover so hover uh, the uh, you know uh, the hover color should be um, you know white and uh, uh, the secondary color should be this one okay so when it will be hover I think uh, it should be also black okay so this is looking nice I go again onto the container here's the top container and here and the advance advance and position make it fixed so you can see this is fixed and make it bottom you know again this is bottom and as well as uh, if you see it is uh, going uh, back into the you know uh, other elements so it's hiding so this is very simple you go to in the z index and make it 5 10 or you know any any uh, good one that you feel that will be okay so this one is okay another thing I feel like I add some more padding here uh, on the top and uh, top padding I make it 10 
so it will look nice okay so here I just click on update and uh, let's uh, refresh our home page and uh, let's see is it looking nice or not so here you can see this is uh, looking very very nice I think so these are the social share buttons and um, these are sticky on the bottom so <coughs> here if you click on any any share button so it will be automatically you know share on your social media accounts for example whatsapp and so on so if you want to make it uh, on uh, floating on the right or on the left uh, this is also very simple I go back and here I select these icons and I will let you know how you can make it floating right on the right side and here I just click here content and here I just select the icons uh, because we need only icons not text because it will be very uh, you know it, it will occupy the whole both space and in the columns I select one column so it will like that and here I just go and uh, in the advance I just remove the right padding make it zero and uh, <coughs> top padding I select this one and bottom as well as 10 and left I make it uh, almost 15 okay so this is right now and uh, as well as if you go here in the border I select the border right should be zero and uh, the bottom should be uh, 20 oh, I think uh, I make it zero or left I think make it 20 so this is looking nice and here I just click on uh, the, the, the setting has been done and if you uh, click on this container and in that container you can see uh, we set the you know element in center you can see earlier so I make it and so you can see this is right now on the end okay so this is very simple sorry yeah, here and uh, this is very simple so this is now right now here and another thing that you need to do is uh, a container width should be in the pixels so here I make it um, 100 pixels 100 pixels so this is on the uh, left side so don't worry I move this on the right so go to advanced setting and here horizontal orientation make it right so you can see this is right now okay so on the offset 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 bottom and there is the offset bottom or top you can see this is right now on the top so offset top I just make it into the percentage so I make it uh, 35 35 okay so it will be bit center okay so here I just click on update and let's see on the home page you can see this is looking very very awesome on the right side as well as so same like that if you want to make it on the left so you can just click on that and uh, or horizontal orientation make it left you can see this is right now on the left as well as if you click on this um, container and make the content align alignment content alignment should be left so you can see this is right now on the left so I make the, some more adjustment uh, click on advance in the advance left padding should be 0 and the right padding I make it 15 and uh, top padding uh, is good left is good right is good okay so gear in the border I just make the border left uh, should be zero uh, make it right 20 and uh, the top should be zero and the bottom should be 20 just like we did the design for right side okay just, just click on update and let's we refresh the browser and see is it on on the on the home page you can see uh, this is looking very nice uh, on the on the left side as well as this is how you can uh, create this kind of amazing social share icons or social share buttons for your website we have learned how we can add uh, the floating uh, sticky social share icons and uh, on the bottom on the left and the right now we learn how we can add uh, the social icons I mean the social icons for the visitors that they can follow you or something like that so this is uh, also very simple so just like that we have added this on uh, on the on the left I duplicate this container and uh, duplicate this container again after duplicating container you can see this one container 
and this container so this container I just make it uh, uh, rename it social share so I can just differentiate the columns uh, the containers and this container I make it uh, social icons so I just name it social icons okay so we can differentiate and in the social icons uh, column I just click here and go to advanced in the advance i make the uh, position fixed and horizontal orientation should be right so you can see here on the right you can see this is on the right so i just go here and uh, again i search for icons so social icons uh, widget i i gonna use so i search for social icons so you can see these are social icons so i just drag and drop uh, into into my container uh, because we have this into uh, the here so I just drag and drop here so this the social icons here you can see these are social icons I just delete that because we don't need here so here you can see these are social icons and in that social icons uh, we can add our Facebook URL uh, for example Facebook page URL and uh, the Twitter YouTube and so on so just like that I add another items uh, just like we added for uh, the you know other you know uh, uh, media icons so I had search for uh, for example LinkedIn so there is the LinkedIn and insert so you can see these are four icons and just like that I just copy that copy here and if I click here and paste style let's see is no it's not pasting the style so uh, don't worry uh, we're gonna style it again uh, as we did for you know uh, our these icons so here I just um, go here so here is the shape so I make it rounder so columns should be auto so I just select the one icon column so this is one column and align it right so these are aligned right and here on the container I just uh, make the alignment of the items just click on container the container in the container uh, alignment and terms should be and so this is on the end so here this is okay so go back and here uh, in the style we just select the style border radius should be zero or uh, we can also select the you know uh, shape should be circle because these are circle and these are social share and these are follow okay so this is uh, very simple okay so here again I just click here and click on uh, on advance in the advance I just click on background and in the background I just select the black color as uh, the background as we selected for other as well as click on border and uh, the border radius I just deselect and border radius uh, left should be 20 and the top should be 20 so this is like that and go here in the layout and uh, the padding left should be um, 20 I think 20 will be more 15 and right should be okay top should be 10 and bottom should be 10 so these are basically the social icons and these are social share I hope you understand these are icon and these are share so I hope you understand uh, how you can add the social share icons and the social icons if you update this you can see these are visible on the left and right these are social icons to follow and these are social icons to share our you know uh, share our website page on uh, the social media uh, so this is very simple I hope you like this video and if you like this video please subscribe the channel and hit the like button and if you have any issue and if you see any kind of issue related to these icons and if you have any custom work related to WordPress or Elementor you can hire me by giving details below into the description of this video thank you so much